panel with me right now. So Tracy Bahar and Derek, and we're going to talk about the thing that they really, like the one thing they really dislike when they see people doing this when applying makeup. I'm almost afraid to ask you guys. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've done like everything on the list. So Tracy, I'm going to start with you. What we are we doing? We had like the long list all of I'm us sure together. You but did. Um, one of the things I can't stand, and I'm sure there's people in the audience who do this, is when they're applying eyeliner, and I don't want to have my false eyelash fall off right now, but uh -huh. they take their eye and they pull it way to the side like this, all the way to their ear, and they go like this and they apply their eyeliner. And then when they relax their eye, they wonder why the eye line is crooked. Well, so, but doesn't that help straighten out your... But, but, but you're... <laughs> no, no. Trust me to say, you're pulling it, you're distorting your eye, and then when you relax it, that's not the way the eyeliner's gonna look. You should keep your eye the way it's going to look when you have your eyeliner on, not for distorting your eye, yeah. pulling it all the way to your ear, and then pulling that. That drives me insane when I see okay. girls do that. Okay, so just leave it as just is. Just leave it as is. And do the little strokes. Yeah, you can maybe pull it just a slight, but like some people, they just take they it. They go to, for yeah, it. Yeah, they go for it. Okay, so cut it insane. out, everyone. Ugh. Um, what else? Do you have a problem with mascara? I have a mas <laughs> mascara people, application. They blink into their mascara wand. Why do you guys do that? Why not? I don't understand that. They take it and they go. <laughs> And so the mouth is like that and too, mouth right? like that, you just can't help. No matter what, that's going to happen. Just take it and wiggle it up. That's what your hand's for. You move it, wiggle it up. You're not supposed to go like this. If you read the instructions, it doesn't tell you to hold it and blink your eye into it. That drives me insane. I can't okay. stand it. I'm not going to do that around you anymore. Don't. Okay, um, I think we have time for one more from you. Foundation. Some of us are putting it on wrong. Oh, when you take it and you rub it into your skin like this. It's yeah. not lotion. Okay? <laughs> lotion, you want to go into your pores. A foundation, you don't want it to go in your pores. Just get a foundation brush and just apply it onto your skin lightly. Do not rub it in hard like that. That also drives you. You're not doing yeah. anything. You're wasting product and it's not covering anything. Okay, got it. I don't do that one, so fine. Okay. Um, Bahar, what, what are we doing that drives you crazy? Um, the general word is poor hygiene. Hey! Yeah, I know. All y'all are dirty out there. <laughs> and it's okay. It's just now we're here to let you know that maybe we can change change some habits. So uh, okay. bad habits, number one, are maybe something simple. When you go to wash your face off or when you go to apply your makeup, wash your hands first. Mm. Your hands are covered in all sorts of gross stuff. There's stuff under your nails. Wash your hands. Very simple. Yeah, that's fair. How about we don't use saliva to oh. loosen up mascara or to get things off our face? There's so many germs in our mouth. Yeah, when your mom was licking her thumb and that was the worst thing she could have done. She should have <laughs> left the dirt on your face instead of transferring more dirt. I know. I know everyone's yeah. dirty out there. Tracy's reading it. Yeah, we're all dirty out there. But that also moves into, okay, fine, that stuff aside, how about when we're traveling with our makeup? Mm -hmm. Well, we have a makeup bag, right? And there's broken bits of powder inside, and then you pull out a brush, and I see people do this, like on the subway, they're putting it on their face, and then they put their brush back in that dirty bag yeah. with the broken product, zip it up, throw it in their purse. Yeah, the I germs, do that. I the do transference. That. Oh my God, it's so simple. I brought a, and I'm in trouble for this from these two, but I brought a prop, right? <laughs> okay. Mini brushes. Oh, they're miniature and they're small and they have their own case so you can close it and place that in your bag. That's so simple. Right. Right. Why didn't I think of that? Wait a second. I did and I put it in my bag. <laughs> And we're done. No more dirty habits. No more no more gross stuff, right? Nice okay. and simple. Okay, so the, but you, you still have to clean those brushes. Yes. You know, wait, yes. that, don't get us started on the, on the, on the rest of it, yes. right? We okay. could really have a full show of this. Yeah. All right, just, just keep this. the broken makeup away from the yeah. brushes yeah. and yeah. throwing it, breaks, it in the same actually, place. Actually, it breaks that same day. Yeah. Spend the time to take it out. Try to fix it. There are hacks that right. Tracy does before. Try to fix it. Clean out your bag yeah. so that you don't make the gross more gross. Yeah. Like organisms multiply, right? Bacteria multiplies. So you can cut it yourself. Okay. Yeah. All right, that's fair. God, we're so agitated today. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. They're so upset with us. Derek, what are we doing Stop now? Stop going to the makeup counter, walking up like you own the place, grabbing the lip gloss and slapping it on. <laughs> that's gross. If someone, a random stranger came up to you on the street and said, here, Try my lip gloss on. You would think they're crazy. So why are you doing it in a retail store? Mm -hmm. Gr it's so disgusting. It's gross. Mm -hmm. Lip gloss, there's no way to apply that hygienically. So try the color on your hands. See if you like it. Do not put it on, number one. Mm -hmm. Number two, there's this weird phenomenon of selling used cosmetics on eBay. No. Oh. Yes. Like used what? Everything. Everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. From, I see like half jars of moisturizers, half jars Ew. of fragrance. Someone's finger has been it. Stop it. Stop. <laughs>
And they didn't wash their hands before no. they put their finger in there, right? It's yeah, no. so gross. No. I didn't know, know that was happening. It, yeah. Go, go on eBay and just put whatever brand and up it comes. And used is so gross. Yeah. That's not for makeup. That's on someone's face, their skin. Yeah. yeah. Um, so no, you you, you the, don't you want know, to be sharing is, any of that. As professional makeup artists, we use hygienic practices to protect our clients and protect the investment of the products that we invest in. Right. There's, so there's something different about that when we're applying versus it's a free for all. So be very careful with you know we're on a hygiene you know, craze. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then the other thing is that happens is your powder products will, will what's called glazing, which oh. is where your oil oh, for sure. causes that film. And I see people try, <laughs> it makes me laugh more than bugs me, but they just can't get the product off. What you can do is you can actually scrape off that top layer um, to remove it. And there actually are hygienic wipes that you can actually use to keep your powder products clean. Okay. But So that I kind of find amusing where people can't understand why they can't get any color off. It's because there's a film, and it's it's actually a film of your own sebum or your own oil that's on there, which yeah. is fine because it's it's your dirt, but you can remove that so that you know the product will work better. And also, don't rest your powder puff yes. on top of the Absolutely. powder. If you're going to rest it, flip it Upside the other down. way because the oils are transferred that's onto right. it. Oh, that's what I yeah. see. Yeah. 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 Even this though you probably got series. it that way. <laughs> oh my yeah. God, we're so annoying <laughs> for these guys. And we're, we're watching. Try and do we're watching. We're I know watching. you are. <laughs>